How long does it take to reverse histamine overload? This is a question we get asked a lot. Anytime we do an Instagram Live or get an email, it's the one question. How long will it take me to reverse my histamine overload? It's actually a question that I've asked myself. When will my immune system rebalance? So it all boils down to your individual histamine load, immune system and leaky gut. You see, your histamine symptoms didn't just start overnight. Your histamine bucket became full over time. So you may have had the odd histamine symptom here and there or noticed your symptoms worsening over time. Even with myself, when I started having urticaria attacks, they just started here and there. I found my trigger was stress. They then gradually became more and more frequent to the point where they were every other day as my histamine bucket became more full. The only way to solve this was to chug down the antihistamines, which actually blocked the histamine receptor from being triggered. Though antihistamines were supportive at times, there were days I just felt lethargic, exhausted, and honestly, it felt like I just wasn't all there and just felt so tired. It wasn't until I discovered detoxing histamine that my journey into the wonders of what is histamine started. You see, everyone's ability to detox histamine is different. As what triggers the mast cells to trigger our histamine symptoms isn't a one size fits all. Everyone's triggers and symptoms are different. Regardless of whether it's medication, food, perfumes, or even supplements, the culprit is the same, histamine. Now, don't get me wrong. It's always positive to remove the triggers, but by removing the triggers, it doesn't mean you are suddenly going to reverse and cure your histamine overload or balance your immune system. It will help as you're not adding to your histamine bucket, but the solution is to subtract and detox the histamine from your body the right way. So let's get into the solution. And if you haven't already followed us on Instagram, then I would recommend as we post a lot of content and discussion on histamine. I'm going to provide you with three steps to not only reverse your histamine tolerance, but most importantly, repair your leaky gut and balance your immune system. Our aim is to detox histamine and break you out of your histamine symptoms and histamine cycle by bringing the immune system back into balance. However, just like how your symptoms and triggers are different, everyone's histamine levels are different. So you may need to take it for longer depending on your histamine load. This protocol lasts 12 weeks and the aim for the first four to six weeks of the protocol is to break you out of your histamine cycle. Once this is done, we aim to continue reducing the histamine load over the following six weeks to ensure your histamine bucket is empty. However, the most important part isn't the protocol. That's just to detox histamine. The most important part is the reintroduction of what triggered your histamine, such as food. So let's get into it. Step one, identify and remove your triggers. Keep a diary of when your histamine symptoms occurred and look at what you ate or what is happening at that time that has triggered your histamine symptoms. This will actually help stop the mast cells from being triggered and releasing that histamine into the body. This will also stop the histamine symptoms that you are feeling to provide you some short-term relief. Step two, detox histamine. You need to follow our simple and effective histamine detox protocol. Take three Toxic Medipure capsules one hour before your first meal of the day with 300 milliliters of water. Then take three further capsules two hours after your evening meal with 300 milliliters of water. Then lastly, mix one Toxic Medi Plus sachet with 300 milliliters of water and drink two hours after your evening meal. You can take the capsules and sachets together if needed. Some people use less water so they're not running for a week all night. If you are going to do this, make sure you keep hydrated throughout the day and drink a big glass of water when you wake up as Toxaprevent needs water to travel through the body. Now step three, and this is the most important step. 
after following the histamine protocol and detoxing using Toxbren, after around eight to 10 weeks, and if you feel ready, start reintroducing trigger foods and see how you feel. Don't worry, if you react, then it's a sign you may need to continue detoxing histamine. So follow steps one and two until you're ready to try step three. Step three is where we all need to be. As I always say, if food was the problem, humans would be suffering much more and there will be no bread, cheese or wine industry. Just remember, when you are doing this protocol, drink plenty of water and eat plenty of fresh fibrous fruits and veggies, as fiber helps to bulk out our stool to make it easier to pass the stool. But most importantly, be kind to yourself and let your body adjust to the detox and histamine. I know it can be uncomfortable to start with, but the most important thing is you will get better. It's time to detox histamine, balance your immune system, and most importantly, reverse your leaky gut. The histamine detox protocol is in the link below. Thank you for listening. Please do hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. And remember, if you want to hear more about histamine, MCAS, and vitamin deoptimization, hit that subscribe button.